He is known for being a renowned German chemist and glass technologist who revolutionized the field of glass development. He is recognized for his groundbreaking research on the relationship between glass composition and properties, leading to significant advancements in optical properties for microscopy and optical astronomy. His name is Otto Schott. In the world of glass technology, one name stands out, Friedrich Otto Schott, a German chemist and inventor who revolutionized the field with his groundbreaking discoveries. Schott dedicated his life to understanding the relationship between the chemical composition of glass and its properties. Through his systematic investigations, he was able to solve fundamental problems and identify compositions that had optical properties approaching the theoretical limit. One of Schott's most significant contributions was his invention of borosilicate glass. This type of glass, known for its durability, thermal resistance, and transparency, opened up new possibilities in various industries. It became a game-changer in the world of optics, particularly in microscopy and optical astronomy. Scientists now had a material that not only offered superb clarity but also withstood extreme temperature variations, making it ideal for scientific instruments. Schott's work has been hailed as a watershed moment in the history of glass composition. His discoveries not only advanced the field of glass technology but also revolutionized scientific research and our understanding of the world. Friedrich Otto Schott's legacy will forever remain as a testament to the profound impact that scientific inventions can have on various industries and the way we explore the wonders of the universe. In 1879, Schott made a groundbreaking scientific discovery. He developed a lithium-based glass with unique optical properties. Excited about his findings, Schott shared this breakthrough with Ernst Abbe, a physics professor who had sparked Schott's interest in glass with his insightful comments on its deficiencies. Schott had noticed the limitations of the available glass during his university studies. Especially in scientific instruments like telescopes and microscopes, the optical performance of the glass was a major concern. As the lens's magnification increased, chromatic aberration became a significant issue. This meant that the quality of the visual image depended on the color of the light, a significant drawback for scientific instruments. Motivated by Abbe's scientific challenge, Schott embarked on a systematic exploration of glass properties and how they varied with chemical composition. He began substituting elements in the glass, such as borate and phosphate for some silica, and fluoride for oxygen. The letter Schott sent to Abbe in 1879 marked the start of a fruitful collaboration between the two scientists. Abbe, along with instrument maker Carl Zeiss, tested the improved glass compositions identified by Schott and Abbe in actual optical instruments like telescopes. In 1882, Schott relocated to Jena to work more closely with Abbe and Zeiss. Together, they delved into the study of glass, experimenting with silica, soda, potash, lime, lead oxide, and 28 other elements. Without a theoretical foundation, they relied on meticulous observation and measurement. Even elements that didn't directly affect optical properties played a role in improving other aspects of the glass, such as reducing surface staining when exposed to air. By 1886, Schott had conducted extensive investigations into the relationship between glass composition and its properties. Through his research, he discovered that the refractive index of glass could be decoupled from chromatic aberration. This led Schott to develop a lithium-containing glass that could approach its theoretical limit in scientific instruments, a significant advancement in optical instrumentation for microscopy and astronomy. Applying his mastery of small-scale melt stirring, Schott achieved homogeneity in his glass production. This enabled precise measurement and characterization of refractive index and dispersion. Through systematic experimentation, he developed a range of glass types. Collaborating with A. Winkelmann, Schott created the first composition property model for calculating glass properties. Schott's ingenious work revolutionized the field of optics, opening up possibilities for more precise and advanced scientific instruments. His relentless pursuit of understanding glass properties and his collaboration with Abbe and Zeiss propelled the field of optical science forward. Do you want to explore more scientists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.